Hi, I'm Professor Stephen Cleveland, and I am a DISC Fellow. Excited to be. Uh, it's been one of the best experiences I've had at Cal State East Bay because I've oftentimes done work with students, but have to figure out a way to manufacture the space, right, to hold, to be able to do that interaction outside of the classroom. And I love having this set up uh, where it's designed specifically to give student interactions with professors outside of the classroom to enliven their educational experience. And for me, the best part of this has been able to spend some quality one-on-one -on -one time with students, uh, listening to their dreams, and trying to connect them with resources. So hopefully you will consider joining us as a DISC Fellow, uh, joining us in 2020, 2021. All right, hopefully see you then soon. Take care. Hey, Cal State East Bay, this is Professor Stanton and I am the Native American Indigenous Faculty Fellow. And we had an awesome year last year, welcoming students from all across campus. And we're excited for this year as well. Um, last year, we had students working on creative writing projects and research projects and, and volunteering. And we also got to meet every week and chat. So I encourage you to send in an application. The way we like to communicate is through Slack, and it's a great way where students can just send me a quick message or we can just, you know, check in. So hope you get to apply to the program this year and hope to see you this year in the DISC. So hi, I'm, I'm Edward Hill, uh, senior um, at CSU East Bay, liberal studies major with a minor in history. Um, and this will be my second year uh, as a returning as a DISC scholar. Um, super excited about the opportunity. Last year I had a chance to work uh, directly with Professor Cleveland um, and about four or five other students in the DISC. Um, and I think it was the first time ever where I engaged in school and academic activities outside of the classroom. Um, and I think that a big draw was the fact that I had Professor Cleveland as a professor in our black films class and so he kind of uh, opened up his classroom to us um, and then opened another door in terms of the disc scholars and I really enjoyed it um, the research we we're able to be a part of uh, building community with like-minded students uh, who are all trying to find their, their own paths at CSU East Bay um, I think it just gave me an opportunity to really feel like a scholar. Uh, and that's one of the things that I, I really appreciated from it. It didn't feel like traditional education. Uh, it felt like something that, it felt like an educational experience that I could build around myself um, with some direction. And I think that that meant a lot to me um, and kind of helped me buy, it, it helped me continue to buy into the process. So, I'm really looking forward to this year uh, and continuing some of the work and doing some new work with Professor Cleveland and whoever else comes on. Uh, I'm looking forward to the new students and hopefully I'll get to see you um, this new year. Hey, I'm Ellen. I was a part of the Native American Fellowship in 2019 and 2020. I decided to join this fellowship because it was an opportunity to research and learn more about the Native Americans living around the Bay Area. If you're looking to spread some roots, maybe explore what the CSU East Bay community has to offer and just learn more about a diverse group of people, I think this will be a great opportunity for you. And my expectations while I was a part of this community were exceeded by far. And I'm grateful for having met an amazing bunch of people and I'd have to say that my favorite part about this fellowship was having the chance to incorporate my major into a subject that I'm very interested in and just making my end of the year project something meaningful to me. So, bye. Thank you for listening.